Well, we're full of good bugs. Actually, we have 10 times more bug cells than we have human cells. So these bugs, the good bugs, are there to do a job. So for example, our gut is full of good bugs and they're an important part of our immune system and they protect us against the bad bugs, the foreign invaders. So I suppose essentially what a bad bug is, is a bug that can cause an infection and do us harm. So what superbugs are, are bugs, be them good bugs or bad bugs, that have developed antibiotic resistance. So they've developed ways of evading antibiotics, so the antibiotics no longer kill them. Antibiotics are life-saving medications. Actually, they've transformed modern medicine. I work in a hospital, and most of the hospital couldn't work without antibiotics. Antibiotics are used for infections caused by bacteria. So examples of infections caused by bacteria are meningitis, um, some chest infections, and also um, kidney infections. Antibiotics do not work on infections caused by viruses. So examples of viral infections are most causes of earache in children, a lot of causes of sore throats, the cold, the flu, and vomiting and diarrhea. So if you have a viral infection, let's say a cold, the best treatment is probably a little bit old fashioned, but it is the best treatment. It's rest, drink lots of fluids, eat well, and let your body do the fighting because most viral infections get better on their own and you can do that yourself.